Good evening, I'm Lauren Culver. And I'm Nicholas Paul. Thank you for watching KX News. In tonight's top story, an ousted police chief is in North Dakota, faces a host of accusations of lawbreaking and wrongdoing on the job, including a case of assault against a child. Matthew Anderson was sworn in as Rolla police chief back in April. The city fired him during an emergency hearing after learning he was under investigation by the BCI and FBI for allegedly committing crimes while in uniform. According to statements at that hearing, the investigation ramped up when a newly hired Rolla police officer approached a BCI agent at a training and asked if he knew that his boss, Chief Matt Anderson, had wrecked two police cruisers. Records show the chief never reported the crashes as is required by law. But according to documents, there is a list of more potentially serious legal problems, including excessive force claims. Anderson reportedly used a taser on a pregnant woman who refused to leave an apartment. And there is an ongoing FBI investigation that the chief reportedly lied about to his bosses. These documents say the chief became upset at a 16-year-old girl who gave him a fake name, so he held her down at a health center and told doctors to put a catheter in her for a urine sample. They found two more victims that were catheterized by, at the direction of Chief Anderson. Uh, none of those did he have a court order or a search warrant or any reason to even get the catheter. Anderson says he can't comment on the matter at the advice of his lawyer, but looks forward to sharing his story one day. He did not admit to or contest the allegations. No.